What is it about this parcel of land, set deep amongst the Georgia pines, that draws us in so? Is it the beauty? Is it the colour? Is it the sound and the breezes? Is it the history? It's all of that. Everything together makes this place special. This is Augusta National. This is the Masters. Now, earlier this morning, one of the Masters' cherished traditions, the honorary starters out there to get the tournament underway. Golf's preeminent global ambassador, Gary Player, a three-time Masters champion, got him started and finished with that classic leg kick. Jack Nicklaus, of course, six-time Masters tournament winner, one of the game's greatest icons, synonymous with Augusta National. And Tom Watson, Masters champion in 1977 and 1981. I can tell you that all three, not surprisingly, knocked it in the fairway to the delight of the patrons assembled. It was then that the Masters tournament was officially declared underway. From the Augusta National Golf Club in Augusta, Georgia, EA Sports so proudly presents the Masters. Today, we begin this annual rite of spring amongst the blossoming azaleas and dogwoods, live opening round coverage of this tradition that is truly unlike any other. This is gonna be a compelling four days of golf. A lot of storylines to follow as we move through the weekend and we take a look at the leaderboard here in round one. Patrick Cantlay is your leader. He's off to a good start at six under. Frank, this is one of the moments you dream about, and you would know this from a very young age. First Masters appearance as a professional. Our featured golfer here, rookie, on such an incredible run at the outset of their career. Already a multiple winner on the PGA Tour. What would need to happen for this phenom to win the green jacket? Well, you would think a miracle, but... Uh to steal a line from Al Michaels and, and just sort of pass along the golf. If you believe in golf, you believe in miracles because I've seen it happen before. I mean, you just go back 2022, Scotty Scheffler came in hot, playing well. Um, should have been the man to, man to beat, but we looked at all those other players. We were world number one and you've already won three tournaments in what was it, four weeks. Might as well be four and five. And that's exactly what it is. Come in with a hot hand, play well, don't worry. Let everybody else worry about all the talking and who the favorites are. Just get out there and play some good old fashioned good golf. And I tell you, that stands up against anybody. Nah, that's a bit timid, and that's got to leave him a lot more than he'd like. Well done. That is in for a par here at the first, and he'll stay at even par. And this is going to be a good result. It's going to catch that slope a bit and keep getting better here at hole number two. That will not be an eagle putt, far from it. It's into the left front bunker here at the second. Oh, how about that 
for a blast out of the bunk, nearly hold it for Eagle. Okay, no problems there. Finishing off a birdie at number two. And this is going to get way up there at three. That a very good drive. So the great tee shot left him here. Now his second from relatively close range. Oh, off the flag stick. So that safely in, it's a car here at the third. And he'll remain in red figures at one under. And this is going to be in the short grass, just off to the left. Just a little over ambitious on that chip shot. Just sailed past. This is an 11 foot putt. Oh, that'll bring a rise smile. A very good putt there to save his bar and he'll remain at one under par. And that will do just fine. And that one barely makes the front of the green. Do you realize if you just miss hit the middle of the club, by a quarter of an inch, you lose 10%. That's right, 10%. Well, if that ball never really got rolling, that's going to come up a good 10 feet short. Yeah, that's well done. He's able to save his par, and he'll remain right where he is.
that one unable to hold the green. It'll come back into the fairway. Lovely pitch shot. Just nipped that ball off the turf. Just flew through the air beautifully. Sat down fairly quick as well. Good shot. Okay, that's good putt. It is in to save par. And he'll stay right where he is. Well, that's an excellent tee shot down the right side. It's just been punished a little bit, though, unfairly, because the hole is cut front right. Second shot straight ahead, and we go to Iona Steven. 125 is the number. Just a flick, pin, front right. It's a sneaky one. That's a good shot, and more importantly too, a green in regulation, so birdie chance. Slope. It is in for a birdie. Nope, that's going to get into the bunker right here at eight, and that is not going to be one that you can get a lot of club on. Okay, that's a good safe play. Get it back out into the fairway. Get some distance if you can and get set to try and make a good third on this par five. That'll do just fine. Birdie putt now moving to his right. Yes, getting hot here just before the turn. That's birdies now at seven and eight. And he'll move to three under par, just three back. Now, 
Got to manage the pine straw here with his second. Oh dear, is that going to get up? No, it will not. And goodbye. That's going to roll a mile all the way off the front of this green. Lovely pitch shot. Just nipped that ball off the turf. Just flew through the air beautifully. Set down fairly quick as well. Good shot. Okay, good putt there for his par here at the ninth. And this is going to be a three under 33 on this first nine. That's good playing. We make the turn here at Augusta National.